Okay, guess what? I have a problem. And here it is. So before I begin, uh, this is a case I got for free. And I'm, um, I'm looking into cases for my DJI Osmo, uh, but for now, this is uh, what we got. So I got everything Velcroed in, even these have uh, some Velcro attachments and their stuff. There is my battery uh, cases. I got one battery in charge right now, it needs to be charged. But my problem is this guy right here. I cannot have this guy just sitting here with nothing protecting it. So I thought, hey, I'm a guy with a 3D printer. I should come up with a solution. Well, I didn't really come up with a solution. I did the same thing I did with a Nintendo Switch. So these problems are kind of a reoccurring theme for me. When I see a problem, I'm like, man, I need to fix the problem. What do I do to fix the problem? The first thing I do is look to my 3D printer, which is the Ender 3, which is doing amazing. So when I ran into this problem with the DJI Osmo Action, I thought there has to be something I can do. So I went to Thingiverse, I looked, and there was. Let me show it to you. This is my solution. It's a simple case that I printed. This is not my design, it was on Thingiverse. So uh, it has two slots here, one for a micro SD card, and another slot for the uh, the uh, the door that comes off so you can add a um, audio device. So yeah, this has came in handy. It's fixed a lot of my problems with this case. So I'm really not in a hurry to get a new case, but basically, you pop it in right here. It's kind of hard to do with one hand. And then you just close it. And there it is. Now this one will not close all the way. That's my fault. I think I broke the little clip that comes with it. But it gets the job done. Just wrap it around the camera. Boom. It's there. So all I have to do now, put this guy in here. Shut this. Put it in my travel case. And we're good. There's nothing I need to worry about. This guy's protected. I don't have to worry about it hitting any of my other nicely rigged devices in here. So yeah. And that sounds a uh, very unique problem that is unique to me. And boom, it shuts. I can zip it. Let's put it with one hand here because I'm super talented. And the camera is going wild. Okay, so yeah, there it is. Everything is secure via Velcro. Now, if I, I'm sure if I give this guy a quick shake or a hard shake, a lot of it will come become undone. But that's it. That's my problem. So yeah, I know a lot of you are thinking, um, why not just buy a new case? And I could, but this one was free, so I was like, I'm, gonna get, I'm going to get this one working, and uh, I'll probably will invest into a better case, but this will work for now. So for the time being, I can keep it in this case, bring it around very easily, with a little handle here, and yeah, problem solved. Yet another problem, 3D printing has solved for me. Well, that's the video, guys. Thanks for watching for this, uh, I don't know what I'm calling this. I guess a quick fix. No, that's too close to Chris fix. Um, I don't know. Short takes. Maybe. But guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.